What's up rats and welcome back to the channel. Today we're looking through r slash wholesome memes. Kind of like a little palate cleanser, you know? Feels real good to look at from time to time. I, I, I have a soul. You have a soul? For wholesome memes. A small friend is still a friend. Look at a little capybara. Listen, mount, mount your friend. No, wait, hold on. I don't want to. <laughs> this is already. <laughs> I mean like a piggyback ride. This already got off the rails. Media complaining about violent video games. Me, too afraid to pick rude dialogue options thinking it would make the characters sad. Listen, video game characters have feelings too, you know? And I don't want to be the one offending these video game characters. It means a lot to me to have a good rapport with these video game characters. Monster under the bed, mosquitoes, arrows, nuclear explosion, angry mom, killer, bullets, cold temperature. Nah, uh, uh. My blanket tells me I'm safe. <laughs> and I'm all like, thanks. What about those? Hold on, let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten arrows that you've missed. That's when your foot's under the, like, just out of the blanket and it's cold and you keep trying to get your foot under it, but you keep losing a little bit of blanket. Is that like a me problem? Might be just, might just be a me problem. <laughs> Three year old me after seeing dad without his beard for the first time. Whoa. You're like a, you're like a whole nother person. You're like a completely different person now. Who is, this is not my dad. No, my dad's got this whole like beard around his face part and like, no, that's not, it's not him. Different guy. Wanna suffer together? Yes. And a few weeks later, look at that. They're happy. Call that compatibility, my friends. Things do work out. What are the Mario Brothers views on side? <laughs> Mario says, <laughs> him running. Luigi says, if there's no hope, get the rope. Mario says, there's always hope. And they hugged it out. Ah, oh, I don't think that's true. See, a little birdie named Matt Pat told me that Mario is a sociopath. He's no good. He's not, good. He's not a good guy. Not a good guy. Mm -mm. At least that's what Matt Pat told me, and I always trust Matt Pat. Seeing a post of broken English, two seconds later realizing OP is learning a whole new language, which is a very hard thing to do. The fact they made it this far is amazing, and hoping to get better at it. That's right. See, I can't. I'm, I'm trying to teach myself Spanish, and dude, I'm do. I'm having such a hard time. And as far as I'm aware, English is like one of the most complex languages. I cannot imagine how difficult it is to learn this language when it's not your first, you know what I'm talking about? There's some words I don't even know, and English is my first, only language. Respect. Sometimes it might feel like it, but you're never alone. Yeah, you got crabs and rocks and jellyfish underneath you. Those are the real friends. I feel sad. I have emotional jumper cables. I'll boost you. Just detach like so. This is a hug. Is it working? Yes. I mean, look at that. A hug cures his problems. I like that. I like, I like, I like that. The warmth. Now you better be careful. You better take off those arm, those, those emotional support jumper cables in the way you put them on. Otherwise you're gonna zap yourself. Hey dad. I tried to make something for you. I hope it tastes good. Dad, even though there was some extra salt in it, it's good, daughter. I loved it. Who called, okay. I know it's supposed to be like heart woman, like, yeah, dad, I can cook. But who, who addresses their daughter as daughter? Like my son, it's funny to say, but if you're going, Hello, daughter. You've 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 automated you've automated your home life, man. That's terrifying. My hands look like this, so hers can look like this, and that's a happy doodling kiddo. What'd you paint? Can't really make it out, but that's okay. When you ask a question in class, and the professor says, "That's a great question." Thank you. I thought about it myself. Took me two seconds. Didn't understand the material. I could build an air cleaning and O2 producing device but I don't know how. I could build an apartment complex for birds and squirrels, but I don't have the time. Or I could do both by planting a tree, but you gotta find a good spot. What are you gonna do in your home? <laughs> Me just tearing down a heartwarming post, but you gotta find a good place for the tree. What are you gonna put it in your home on the windowsill? That's not good. Then you're gonna have a tree in your house. I already got tree in my house and I ain't planting it and I'm smoking it. <laughs> I hope you find someone who knows how to love you when you're sick. Taking her to the shower, bathing her, washed, drying her off, and then putting on her... You know, that's great. How sick is she in this post? That she cannot make it to the shower, and he has to hand wash her. How feeble, like genuinely how feeble is, is this person? Because now I'm concerned. Me is angry the whole day. Mom makes my favorite dish. Me after eating it. Yummy! Okay, I'm good now. Let's play video game. Maybe Mario? Play Mario Kart, maybe? On Switch? Mario on Switch? Stop scrolling. Ask yourself, am I seeing posts that make me unhappy? Do I follow accounts that make me feel like I need to be someone I'm just not? Am I comparing my life, body, or success with others? Is the way I use social media affecting my mental health negatively? Just want you to be happy. Well, thanks. But I'm looking through wholesome memes. Of course I'm new and happy. Question is that. <laughs> we always see Kermit memes where he's crying in the shower. 
sadly touching his face or sipping tea. But look at the growth. My man's frolicking through dandelions. That is tranquil as fuck, dude. You sure have a pretty face. You mean this face? <laughs> I love that I get to do those sounds. Yep, exactly. Oh, look at that. Why are they saying looks don't matter? They're making they're just making silly faces. I, just making silly faces. Okay. <laughs> of course looks don't matter, but it's just silly faces. And I think that matters a lot, depending on the silliness of the face. Just saying. Observe, this creature is a friend, as is this creature. Why? Because they both consume creatures that pierce us and drain our life fluid. Existence is terrifying. At least we have friends. I love my little alien brother. Come on now. Go observe humans in probe. I ain't talking about probing for answers. That's a real beast of a dog you got there. Huh? What about you? Yours is so chubby. Cool if I pet yours? Yeah, man, go ahead. Listen, I know that I know you that you're the Yakuza and all, but honestly, you have to do it, dude. Go for it, man. Pet my dog. When you're broke, but she believes in your dreams. That's cute. That that's adorable. Listen, he doesn't got a lot of money, but he's got a heck of a he's got a heck of an imagination, and that's priceless. You come across a dire rat. I try to befriend it and keep it as a pet. A wolf stands in your path. I try to befriend it and keep it as a pet. Before you stands the demon lord, Baphomet, prince of beasts. <laughs> now he sleeps right next to me. Yo, check it out. That chip bag is doing a pog. When you check the fridge at 3 a.m. and there's actually food inside. Oh. <laughs> My chaotic girlfriend being herself. Me, slightly agitated, but still more in love with her than ever. That's very nice, dear. Now, can you stop crawling on the ceiling? You're scaring the neighbor. Please, we're trying to have a polite for dinner with our new neighbors, and here you are, being old exorcist on the goddamn... What is this, I am legend? What is this, legion? Get off of the ceiling. I still love you. My dad, my other dad, seven-year-old me asking to fly. Dude, let's go. Thanks, dads. Teacher makes an unfunny joke. Me and the boys, who laugh because we appreciate his efforts of being a good teacher. <laughs> Thank you, teach. Maybe if I laugh, I'll get a little bit of extra credit. You know, adoption may not change the world, but for Tyler, the world will change. <laughs> I love his little face. He's like, oh boy, I'm gonna go to a new home. I wanna play video games, eat french fries. I wanna drink olive oil, all the oil. Me counting how many smiles that I put on people's faces today. One, just one. And that's mine, wholesome memes. That's my face that you put a smile on. Me learning basic commands in R. My programming boyfriend. Oh, well, he's proud of you. You gotta start somewhere. You gotta start somewhere and I'm proud of you. Even the sun's smiling. I tip my hat to you. One legend to another. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I just want to tell you how great you are. You're smart, caring, and so beautiful. Hey, dog, you almost done in there? Almost. You're a winner, guy. Don't you ever forget that. I don't feel good. Well, that's because you're not good. You're amazing, turtle. Now get on out of here, you scamp. I'm the devil. I gotta go kill things. Get on out. Go, go, go get on out of here. Turtles don't go to hell. <laughs> they go to turtle hell. Me, I love you. Girlfriend, I love you too. Me, fist in the air, silently screaming, let's go. <laughs> now watch as I break dance, babe. Break dance to your love. Oh, you're too tall. Hang on. Mwah. Now you're in the air. I'm not letting you go either. This is your life now. Now you will never not be not tall enough to kiss me. <laughs> I've given you the power of levitation. When you just started at the gym and a bodybuilder says, I see you, big dog. Thanks, man. I'm glad you see me. Because soon enough, you're going to be seeing these muscles, man. You're going to be seeing these muscles. I'm talking abs, pecs, and don't forget the glutes. When you unwrap your new phone and slowly pull off the plastic screen protector, just, oh, yeah. <laughs> Love peeling off that screen protector. Because I do all my things without protection. <laughs> <laughs> me and my doggo who comes to check on me every time I take a bath in the tub. You must care a lot. Your heart must be very pure. That's right. Well, you know, depends on the dog, I should say. My dog would be like, hey, hurry up. I'm hungry. I know I just ate. I'm hungry. Get some rest. I'll watch over you. Mama, one day I'll be big and strong like you. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, okay, bud. Go to sleep. Whatever, idiot. Sleep. Please, can we go again? Okay, little guy. One more orbit. I had taught you all I had to teach. Now go and make your first friend. All right. But I already made a friend. Let's go grab something to eat, friend. That's cute. It's not about the, the destination, but the friends you make along the way. Trash can, crumpled paper, 
Kid saying, Kobe. Kobe in heaven. Yes. You sink that crumpled paper. Do me good. R.I.P. When you can't read, but nobody gave up on you and trying to teach you to read. <laughs> Thank you. Now I can read. Now I can pick out exactly which Blue's Clues episode I wanted to watch. Thank you. Uh, you know, that's a very obscure joke when I say that because it was the Blue's Clues DVDs that taught me how to read. I kind of just figured out what jumbles of letters I wanted to see. <laughs> That's a real story. That's how I learned to read. Password, racism, that's weak as fuck. New passwords, equality, and love, and that's strong as hell, man. We all come from one place, Earth, that's one love. That's a strong ass password, ain't nobody cracking that. Though you showed it on Reddit. Now I'm gonna hack your, <laughs> now I'm gonna hack your banking details, idiot. Me accomplishing the smallest of tasks. My weird friends who are always there for me. Yeah, you go, man. You know, uh, okay, J just to t not, not to take anything away from the post, it's a cute post. Um, have we really gotten to a dystopia where we're just hanging up rice, uh, cinnamon toast crunch on the wall? <laughs> is this, is this where we are? <laughs> is this, is this 2020? Shit's crazy. How they seen themselves. Closed. How you see them. And that's all inside a walnut with a hinge? That's actually incredible. I'm just impressed with the craftsmanship at that. Wow. Nobody. My grandma. Don't tell nobody I gave you this. Listen, I'm telling you, dude. The gramps and the grannies be out here for the grandchildren. They put, they put in work. <laughs> I think it's because they know they don't have to. They could just pretend they're old and senile, but nah. They put in a little bit extra for the grandkids. They keep it real. Students at Ufind Lake College of Pharmacy have developed a chemical compound that kills, and stick with me here, gliobastoma, brain cancer cell. They have also refined it to ignore healthy brain tissue and focus on the cancer cells. That is crazy. I'm, that is like actually ridiculous. That's, that's a crowning achievement, dog. Good for them. And good for the patients too. That's just a breakthrough in medical science, you know? Humpty Dumpty did have a great fall. He took a walk around the falling leaves, made a couple of jack-o'-lanterns, read by the fire, and picked a couple of fruits. He did have a great fall. Thank you very much. Me and my buddy. So I've graded all your tests. Question seven seemed pretty tough, so I didn't count it against you. Aw, oh, thanks, Teach. You know I had problems with that question seven. I about damn near cried. Now me and my buddy get to fist bump. Me kissing my mom before sleeping because she deserves all the love. Aw. You know, the title, with this, the, the title with this is adorable. It reads, Life doesn't come with a manual. It comes with a mother. Same thing. Starts with an M, stupid. <laughs> <laughs> love your mothers. I love mine. Love your mothers. More body positive mannequins is what the world needs. Hey, rock with it. Rock with what you got. Make that shit work. That's, that's, that's my only advice. Listen, I'm a big boy. Here, here's the fact of it, okay? You can, you can be a big person. That's fine. I know I'm a big boy, but I'm still, I rock what I wear. I look fine as shit, and you can too. That's truth, that's facts. No printer. Me getting a happy meal after crying for an hour because I want to be happy again. <laughs> I like that it implies that I can only be happy with happy meals. When I finished the last apple slice, I suddenly felt a great sadness. Please, please get me a happy meal. The chocolate milk jug is cold and yummy. And there's fries and a burger and a toy. <laughs> I, d I guarantee you I can't be happy until I have a McDonald's brand happy meal. And that's the truth. <laughs> <laughs> and that's gonna do it for this video and if you enjoyed please leave a like down below and subscribe for more content every single day and comment down below what somebody you want to see next if you want to follow pan and i on social medias you can find those in the description down below until next time i'll be seeing you